Hello everybody, welcome to the absolute final game of this season of Super League. Where, um, I have failed to qualify behind Seabros. Chunter has lost all four of his games so far because he has Impeal and Ability and Knobs are absolute rubbish. So uh, this should be a, a very easy win for me. I am absolutely 100% confident of victory here. Easiest game of my life. Absolutely zero chance of losing. Uh, pride never comes before a fall. In the booth with me is... Um, Moridam and Dimmy. So there you go. Take it away, chaps. I'm going to concentrate on playing, uh, even though I don't need to, because it's a guaranteed victory. Wow, that's a hell of an intro. Uh, that's some pretty mixed messages there, if you ask me. Yep, uh, Jimmy's definitely got this. I'm just gonna go ahead and create a poll in the chat and put all of my money on Chunter. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to create a poll. I'm too lazy for that. Absolute confidence. <clears throat> so, Nob's on defense. Yep. And he's got... Yeah. Yeah, this, see, this is the... this Jonathan's Nob team is actually it's closer to the one. a lot of guard. Yeah, Six he's... Guard, got, right? That's not it's bad. It's five. That's, that's the Wraith. So, oh, it's the Wraith. Yeah, uh, he's got yeah, five, yeah, five yeah. guard. And he's got that's a bludge. Still good. Sure hands and a bludge tackle. He's got 12 players. He's only got two re-rolls and he's got no leader though. But he does have an apo. Yeah. Does so, he have a spare player as well? He's got, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's yeah. actually gone for two throwers. So he's two throwers on the LOS because they're oh. higher AV. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so he puts them on the LOS to try and have as many players as possible. Okay, makes sense. Uh, well, I, it's not what I would do, but I understand why you might. And this has a lot of guard on both teams, actually. I'm just realizing that Jimmy's also got four guard. Yeah, so funnily enough, Jimmy's gone four guard, uh, one block call, one block wolf, and one wrestle wolf. So there's a pack that gives Necromantic more money, which means they can fit all the positionals and still have three rerolls. Yeah. Which is pretty good. So that what did he roll? Good. Oh, I missed the roll for the year. The AV on the thrower. <laughs> Wanted to see what you are. So free dice, pretty nice. Oh, that wouldn't have broken armor on anything. No. If you're gonna roll snakes though, it might as well be there. Yep. Hmm. Mm. Interesting. Not, a, not not the best LOS I've ever seen. It's because knobs are OP. It could be. It could be. I don't think it is, though. I think it's because uh, this is typical gym dice. It's not the typical gym dice that I've seen. Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, you, your experience with gym dice is uh, a bit unique, Jimmy. A bit unique. Jimmy didn't blitz. See? Oh, he didn't really have a good target, did he? No ability is so OP. And it struck fear into him, so he couldn't blitz anything. Okay. Blitz in a zombie. No, no. Oh, instant armor break. Instant armor break, yeah. Jimmy takes stun. all those hits on the LS and it gets broken armor on. It's a good sign, yeah. it's a good omen for the nobility. Yeah. Beautiful position in there. None of their own players had their armor broke as well, so yeah, that's, you know what? It's, that's, um, not, that's about as good as you can hope for on the one, one of the big problems with knobs is when you're on offense and half your team decides to lay on the floor. That's That's yeah. the big issue. So just keeping a nice rigid shape. Yep. Has given him the uh, blitz with the wolf into the one, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, oh, he's probably he'd have to do GFIs for it. He did give him the little box shape. Does he get follow up? Oh no, stand firm, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So bro so OP, man. 
Bodyguards aren't bad. Yeah, I love them. The wrestle as well. I, wrestle. It's not as good as block, but there's, you know, it's still really good. Well, yeah, it's just the wrestle and the stand firm, so it, it's. Like, you can't push them off, and then you can't just knock them over. Like, well, if you knock them over, you're knocking yourself over, right? Now, so. Yeah. The only they're... issue is when they get powered and they leave the pitch, because they're AV9+. Yeah, yeah. They're not the fastest players either, like movement 6. Like, most positionals are, like, movement 7. True. But, typical human movement, right? Movement yeah, six. yeah. Armor 6, or armor uh, 9+. Nine plus. Plus, yeah. Ooh. Jim just eats it. Not, not yep. armor broke though. Jim already wanted to get forward. Turn two, he's like, oh my god, there's four stand firmers. Get forward, get forward. Yeah, you gotta. You gotta I'm get forward where you man. can. You don't wanna you don't wanna fall too behind early. So yeah, it's hard to get get past four stand firms. What's the what's the wraith, right? Uh yeah, I think so. Yeah. So you based them up, so you blitz the wraith, hope you get them down and yeah, if he blitzes the wraith and gets them down he can also hit the column as well. Uh not easily. I mean, he can one dice them, but Unless he removes them, he, right? The sidestep, he can just sidestep oh, into that space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to sidestep straight down, yeah. Yeah, which is definitely what you do. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kind of thought that tackle piece was going to be the blitzer. I don't want to get oh no, he's going for that one. Going for that one. Yeah. It's a dicing. <laughs> that's uh, that's pretty bad. Losing a wraith. Oh man, it didn't even regen. Oh my no, god, didn't even regen. Yeah, that's that's pretty horrendous. That's pretty horrendous. It's it's karma. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's karma. Oh man. Oh. He's just sadly like caressing it with his mouse. <laughs> <laughs> his favorite fucking player. Yeah, that's huge on turn two as well. That's yeah, pretty grim. Yeah, I mean, I think if it had been the reverse, right? If Jim had removed like one of these bodyguards on turn two. Yeah. Pretty brutal. It's pretty brutal. The the only thing is now is will he keep his head and play well for the rest of the game, or is he, <laughs> is he gonna start? <laughs> Leaving free gap screens and stuff. <clears throat> Only time will tell. Yep. I feel I like he might not be mentally open. prepared going into this one. I feel like he might not be. What? What are you saying? J Jim was the very, very face of confidence going into this game. I mean, his team name is Absolute Confidence, so you would believe. Yeah, right? Maybe he won't allow himself to lose the nobility. Gets the power on the ogre, this would be huge. Okay, yeah. Not even and an armor break. Nothing. Wow. Yeah, it would have been big. That would have been, yeah, he, he's going to need something like that, I think. Yeah. Um, even just a stun would have bought him some time there. Yeah. Right. Well, hopefully, like bonus or something. You know. Bodyguards doing bodyguard stuff. Yeah. Love to see it. 
And then we... Oh my god, there's just like a... You can get a 1D with Wrestle here really easily. You can get a 2D. Uh, yes. Oh no, he's... he's yeah, so he moves this guy out of the way and then he puts the ogre in, then he blocks and then he gets the uh, wrestle around the back. So this is an easy 2D. Yeah. Easy 2D. He just needs... He has to do the 1D though with this bodyguard. And then get the yeah. push. Oh Ooh. god. Skull. Puts in the reroll. Wow, okay. So now now it's a huge 2 plus from the ogre to step in. And then we got the sack. Oh, he's up. He's in. Yeah. And now we got the wraparound blitz. It's a pretty good direction for uh, Chanter as well because he's got the yeah, short hands out on the, the, pal. Uh, the full pal. The full pal. Where's that ball going? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's, it's the best scatter for Jim. Two tackle zones. Yeah. If the wolf had caught it, that'd have been good as well. All right, bounced into his hands. Had a chance. Yeah. So it's the best scatter for Jim. Yeah. I guess we're just putting the tackler on the goal and then probably one, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven. Yeah, yeah, you can put the tackler on the goal without making a geofire. The only problem is, is that it's going to be... I don't know what square that Wraith is in. I uh, he for the pickup. He's just below the other tackle, the, guard, the bodyguard back there. Yeah. Yeah, they are a yep. little floaty, right? They're hard to tell where they're at. They move around a lot. Oh. Oh. Double uh, skull from him. Gets a removal. Okay. Wow. That helps a little bit. Done. Yeah. Only a little bit, though. Right, so he gets another piece of pow. It's a guy on the ground. The, the AV9 Plus is uh, coming in clutch there. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what a Dyson. Yeah. Oh, Blitz and the Bodyguard. Let's see how this works out. Uh, <laughs> OP! OP! Goes for another... Oh, okay, gets in this okay. time. Gets the double powers, yeah. Took both the flashies to do it, though. And he's already blitzed as well, so I don't know what he's doing about this ball. I don't know either. And he's going to do the 3 plus dodge. See, this is what, like, I was thinking that that was going to be the tackle guy on the ball and not the, uh... Jim showing that he clearly doesn't know how assists work there. Yeah. Oh, I don't... I don't like that. And it's into one... Uh... Not into uh, one. That's into it, uphill. No, no, it's into one. It's, uh, no, it's into one. It's into one. It's one into one. Not I think that's stands for. If he doesn't stand firm, he goes. Oh. To be into red because. Oh, because the, the ogre. Oh my god, and then he double powers. Oh, but <laughs> double powers. Double powers. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh my god. Doesn't break armor, though. Then, oh, and the ogre's got. Oh, he's the wrestle wolf. He's the wrestle one. <laughs> the wrestle wolf. Amazing. And the ogre didn't have block either. That would have been such a good power. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, he's done all right. He's done all right. Yeah, he's re he's recovered a little bit here. His dice weren't doing him any favors, except for that uphill, which was yeah, real good. Um, I don't see him. So no he's armor breaks. He's got to try and scatter this. I think. Oh, he's gonna have to try and hit this rave. I don't think Jim has broken armor. Like the guy that uh, removed himself removed himself, right? Yeah. Right, bear with me two minutes. I'm going to be right with you, mate. Yeah. Oh, foul appearance doing work. Into a pow. That's okay. Yeah, because you can cover up that square. What's he gonna do here? Blitz the. Oh, he can't get rid of him. Yep, just gets another guy on the ball. 
chain push. All sorts of a mess in there now. That ogre is definitely a problem. I'm just getting shut down by all the guard. Himself a 2D on the, on the bodyguard. Yeah. But stand firm. It's one of them down, so now we can probably hit the ogre. Oh! Armor break? It's a removal! That is exactly what Jim needed. Get one of those. Knob bastards off the pitch. Okay, hit on a thrower. It's probably going to be another roll of an eight on the armor roll. Nope, not a five. Shame. Ooh. Knocks him down. Yeah, pushes himself over. Out of the ball. You love to see it. It's another bodyguard now. See now now Jim's dice are, are doing alright here. It's another removal another one gone. Look at it. You love to see it. Jim it's it's Dimmy. Dimmy's the, the curse on this on this stream. Dim leaves for a minute and Jim removes two people. The third? Oh. Still. That is three less guard for next turn. It's a lot of a lot of chaos. There are a lot of a lot of stuns. Jim's got what, two people total? Now, and two guards on the ground stunned. Ogres on the ground has the two plus to get up. Covered pretty well. Yeah, he appoed the, the one removal. Yeah. Yeah, Christopher, I saw. I, I noticed now, and I was like, I don't remember him getting a stun there. But yeah, you're right. He. He appled that other one. Still huge. Blood Bowl's at its best when it's like this. So it's like a cluster, cluster fuck of of men, dice, big sweaty men, just banging. Oh, doesn't get him down. Stands firm. Jimmy's missing all the fun. he even have here to hit he can one dice either the fleshy or the the wraith it's not great this one has side stuff the other one is stand firm and hunters not in a great spot this turn 
Maybe you one dice the one dice with tackle on the the wraith. Oh no. Dodge out and blitz him. Gets the pow. Where does Jim go with this? Probably onto the sideline. Yep. You, sit, you don't want to be too close to that wolf. You don't want to be too close to the sideline. Getting blitzed off. Probably just head back, right? Where do you put both of them on the ball? Not easy to. It's not easy to surf you with with the ball on the ground next to them. Oh, he does go back. Yeah, sensible. Giving up, sitting on the ball. Jim, a little pressured for time here. Only three turns left. Oh, who's he, who's he dodging? Ooh! Oh, that guy over there. Well, that's, uh... That's swinging things hard now. The player difference is gonna start adding up pretty quick. Gets the bodyguard on the ground. Can you get the ogre on the ground? Not there. Put him up on there, though. Just push. The ogre off the ball. I'm probably thinking about where to where to go after picking this ball up to get safe. Sorry about that, dude. Ah, Jim, you missed you missed some excitement. I missed the uh, whole half, man. <laughs> you did. I had to do some uh, stuff. Oh, the you, ball's you, still on the floor. The the yeah, the ball's still on the floor. But the instant you left, uh, the knob dice have dried up. A uh, Bunch of them have been removed. Apo's been used, but uh, Apo. So how many knobs are on the pitch? One, two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven. So four yeah. down. Oh. Four down. Yeah. Ooh. Ball's still on the floor though. Has Jim got? Uh, Jim still got three re rolls. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Chunter um, Apo'd a KO on a bodyguard. Right. Another bodyguard got KO'd. Has he not got? He's got three bodyguards there. Oh, uh, and he, he apple one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he he apple the one KO, and then the other was stunned. Uh, yeah, <clears> yeah, <throat> and then another uh, peasant uh, smashed his knee trying to dodge. You know, like <laughs> a peasant. Nice. Did he roll a three? Because it's it's always better when they roll a three. I didn't. I didn't check. I was too busy uh, laughing that he had smashed his knee. So is he going so. for? The, he's going to go for the ghoul pickup, I guess. Where's the blodge ghoul? Oh, he's there. He's there. He's there. Yeah, yeah, he's there. He's tied up. Yeah, it's looking yeah. pretty comfortable now. Well, I say he's got to pick the ball up first. He, but... he does have to pick the ball up, but if he can, he can... Oh, another removal. Just going in there, wow. Uh... Hmm. Well, uh, yeah, I feel like I would have gone to the right. Right? A little more yeah. Unlucky. He still has a blitz, but... It's two into one? Is it? Uh, yeah, 
two into one. Frenzy opportunity. Double skulls. Pushes into one D. Oh, he gets the push. Like a dog. Oh, he can chain the blitzer out now. Uh, but then yeah. what? You can chain yeah, the attack the blitzer out as well, more importantly. I guess you... Oh, you can't hit the wraith because of the two guarders. Yep, yep. Oh, four removals, three KOs. He's got one bench though, right? So, you get, he'll yep. potentially get two KO rolled. <laughs> All just right, <laughs> yeah. Jimmy wants to mention his uh, <laughs> deceased one. rave. Yeah. yeah, he's real sad, but still, you know. What yeah, it's a fair trade. Three tails, man. Yeah, pretty good. He's got the ball. He's got two turns. So I mean, Chano could play this pretty defensively because everyone on the Liquid team is really slow, except for the wraith, the wolf, and the ghouls. Yeah, the wraiths aren't him. fast either, right? They're just moving six. Well, if so he that... hits, if the ogre hits the wolf and powers it, that's going to remove the wolf from the rest of the drive. Well, not the rest of the drive, but for yeah. like the next turn, and then yeah. he'll be on the ghoul. Like, mm... it's only a one dice though. What the ogre? Well, if he stands up the bodyguards. It oh, yeah, makes yeah, it a one dice. It is a yeah. one dice if he stands it up. Right now it's red. Oh, yeah. Right? It's not oh, easy. Man. I mean, you could hit the wolf with the peasant for a one dice. <laughs> Do you know what? Uh, I don't I, I don't mind dodging a bodyguard out, going between the wolf and the ghoul, and then blitzing the wolf on the two dice, hoping for the pow, and then stepping in behind the ghoul. But yeah. even that's how he stood him up. Mm. Well, maybe he's going to blitz with the other guy. Oh, he's just dodging. Oh, so the, yeah, now it's the two dice on the wolf with the ogre. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. And then yeah. He gets the pow. He can chain out the tackle. It's a go sweeper. You chain out the. Tackle or do you chain out the thrower? I chain out the tackle. I mean, you could chain out the thrower and then dodge the and then tackle. just dodge the other yeah. two, yeah, because they've got dodge, right? But then if he's doing that, then he needs to follow. Where I weren't going to follow, I was going to stay on that ghoul. Yeah, it's hard. It's a hard. This is a hard turn, honestly. I don't really it's, know. He's a lot of players down. I mean, he wants to keep him boxed in on this corner, really. Okay, I'm not sure if that's a mistake or not. Uh, I mean that's that's a pretty great knockdown. Yep. Not gonna lie, that's a pretty great knockdown. Yeah. Where do you? Oh, foul appearance. Oh, foul appearance. And that means he can't move him whatsoever, so he's just stuck in that square as well. It's not the worst square. Yeah. It's not the best square. It's not the worst square. Now, Jimmy, enjoy your turn seven. <laughs> I don't think it's... well, I say it's not too hard. Uh, there's definitely a lot of dice involved. Well, he, he, he started um, clicking very quickly, so it looks like he knows the play he wants to do. Yeah, surf. Surf, and then what? What dodge through? Oh, yeah, the oh no, then he can just run down the side, yeah. Yeah, yeah just run down the side. side. That foul appearance really screwed him over. Yeah, it's a... Foul appearance is pretty good, yeah. Yeah. It's a, it's a one into a two, but it's... It's like, only I played I played um, Nurgle at a tournament recently, and it was so much fun, foul appearance. Especially when, like, it's big guys trying to blitz you, and they have to roll a two plus to activate, and then a two plus for foul appearance before they even do anything. It's... Yeah. It's a lot of the fun. fact that you don't move. Yeah, right. it's killer. Oh, he gets the one D. He's gonna take the power here. You have to, don't you? you can't yeah, stay. and then he has to stay on the pitch. He does oh, stay on the pitch. Stun. A stun is huge as well. It means you don't yeah, have to give a shit about that guy. You just. Yeah, both blitzers stuns. What a lucker dog. What an absolute lucker. Deserved. Deserved luck. 
Oh my god, it's not. It's not deserved. We're, we're gonna be on opposite sides, Jimmy. It's not deserved. <clears throat> it's not even um, luck, it's 100% skill. Jim just rolled the skill. dice better. Deserved win. Well, yeah, deserved win of this there's, drive. There's nothing you can do here, this is done. Mm. Especially with those, yeah. Uh, so what yeah, are we looking at? We're looking at a 4-4-3. Four, 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 four. Four four three. If he goes to the oh, yeah, wall, four four three, yeah, yeah. The wall, goes up. And then out and then back in. No recovery really. And then it's a one D <laughs> Oh man, that that's disgusting. And yeah, you can make it way harder by yep. By doing that. Now it is a six. Take the both down, don't you? So fuck that guy. Get on yeah, the ground. It's done. Yeah, it was a. It started off real sketchy for Jimmy. Oh, then the bonehead. I'm really, su I'm really surprised he didn't go for the pickup. That turn when he sacked him, I thought he'd go because he had sure hands. So it was a five plus with oh, a yeah, reroll. Yeah, I thought when he blitzed with the sure hands onto the wraith and got him down right. I thought he was going to pick up that turn at the very least. It's a 5 plus yeah. pickup with sure hands, right? 55%. 3 plus dodge back out. And GFI to kind of get to a semi. No, not really safe, but kind of ish safe. And you've got the other the other guy to kind of try to screen a little. I think he's just worried about getting surfed afterwards. That's the thing. Well, you're definitely getting somebody surfed afterwards with that play. That's the, yeah, that's the thing. But, but the alternative was to just leave the ball on the ground completely unbased yeah right? it's i mean there's no good option there it's just Ooh. too bad Dubley pals yep. Dubley pals dead wrestle wolf oh no one one short of a an armor break there you don't throw a block here do you i guess maybe you do yeah you get three dice on the the thrower beat him up Let's see if, uh, if Jimmy's gonna do the dance on the emote. I mean, you got it. All right. You got it. You got it. 3 plus into a 3 plus. So you're not hitting the ogre then. Nah. Nothing. What's this? This is. This is next level BM. Oh my god. <laughs> this is a, a dancing. He's gonna dance them all. Look at that. Oh my god. He's what dancing them all. Custom. See, this is too far. This is too far. All right. Uh, yeah. Well, it's it's Dimmy end of an era, early GG levels of, of dance now. For the love of God, Jimmy, just just run Put all the in. money back. Put all the money back on Trunter. In the old days, this would have uh, this sort of dance would have provoked Nuffle to throw a rock and kill your ghoul. Oh, it would be amazing, yeah. And the incitement. Who's that? Is that Borak? Is it? Wow, I need to get yeah. Borak. He's definitely oh, yeah. the best coach. Uh, it's Borak and the fat toad. I don't have either. Though. I don't have any of them. I've got like. You don't helmet. have any of them? No, oh, I haven't complete. I haven't ever completed the blood pass. Oh shit! You need to at least play enough to get the fat toad and Borak. Yeah, they are the best, the best coaches available right now. I like how he had a really shady drive and then celebrated. That's that's proper Dimmy style, that is. <laughs> like barely scoring, having to roll five pluses and then celebrating like I was really good. One rave though for the defense is going to be. It's going to be rough. Yeah, yeah. Jim really needs that one KO to stay out. <laughs> well, that yeah, if he has to stay out, be huge. Yeah. yeah. So he'll be down a player then, which is pretty big. He's going to get he's going to get a mighty blow here, here and he's going to get two others. Yep. Are we going for a one-turner? One reroll? I mean, it's doable. Unlikely, but doable. 
Yeah. No, he's, he's setting up for it. He's setting up for it. Yep. Well, yeah, there's no reason not to, right? Although there should be a guy behind the dodger, the tackle guy. I oh, know he's not setting up for it. He's not set up for it. Wow. What did he get? Change of weather? Yeah. Just throwing blocks. It's the power of the mighty blow. This is the important one. Dead, yep. dead, dead. Nothing. Nothing. Not even a scratch. Well, you might go for the one tonny, you know. I, I guess it's a 5 4 3, right? It's yeah, it's, it's unlikely. It surrenders, yeah. I probably would have set up for a riot instead. But... No armor break, but nothing out of it. Guess the follow up hit. Yeah. I wonder if he fouls. It's it's a hard foul to do as well. Cause, no, because the only yeah. guys he has available for the fouls are the, the, the bodyguards. Yeah, yeah, he's not gonna foul. He'd be crazy to foul with any of the put pieces he has available to him. Wildly inaccurate. What the hell? Oh, he threw it to the end of the pitch. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh. No hands. No hands. No hands. No hands. Fucking. Squirrel sympathizing race. That's what they are. It's a squirrel in a coat. It's a squirrel in a coat. Did the KO come back? It did. Diced. So 11 against 11. Uh, Is Chano going to go for the win? Is he going to go for the draw? I don't know yeah. that I see Chunter go he has for got the, the draw uh, very he's often, got the, right? He's got to try and avoid. He's got to try to avoid the 0, 0 and 5, but... Yeah. <laughs> but... Does he? Does he I have to? I don't know. I mean, you're just having fun at this point, and you know, you're just playing. Yeah. The... Chunter almost always goes for the win. Yeah, I think so. I don't know. It's That's why to... he's 0, 0 and 4, Timmy. <laughs> yeah, true. True. I mean, right. he's been incredibly unlucky as well. Like, some of the games... Like, his game against Seoul, he was just incredibly unlucky. Yeah. This game against Davo, he was a three plus away from probably drawing. And then I can't yeah. remember the dwarf game, he just got diced horrendously. Yeah. Dwarf's in it. He's had yeah, he's had like he's had not only is he like had it rough like like removal wise, he's he's just been on the bad end of he's been really close to like winning a couple of these games. Yeah. Now, what would you do here, Demi? Would you go for the win? Or would you just go for the draw? If if it was you, right? Zero zero four. Whoa. You're against Jim. Jim I'd talked know, a lot of hot know. shit about just winning this game. No, you know. I don't know. I'd probably go for the win. Stupidly. Like also the other thing is as well is like Necro are like pretty hard to stall against and like. They are. I, yeah. I feel like knobs are just so much better on defense as well. It's like. You got nothing to lose. Just no, I don't know. It's hard to say, really. Gets the touch back as well, which is an absolute dream. Yeah, you probably go for. I'd probably go for. I mean, I, I had said last game, right, with the Soul Andy game. I always go for the win. Yeah. A draw. Going for a draw is just going for a, a loss. I think. I think the humiliation of Jim losing to Nobs would just spur me on to go for the win. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't look like he's going for it though. Because I probably would have gave it to somebody else. Because uh, he was so far back. If I was going for an early score. Early ish, yeah, yeah. I guess. That's a good start. Played on the pitch, yeah. sadly. Still, you know, stunned. You got to take what you can get at this point. He's got a three dice with the ogre if he wants it. Oh, 100%. Yeah. Well, it's a matter if he hits there or if he wants the ogre to blitz somebody. Bits of golem. I don't mind this as well. Like removing a golem is so oh. freaking good. Get the snack, pow. Huh? Oh, no. boo! No. Rolls a three. Yeah. What a Dyson. We'll see how aggressive he's gonna be. Whether he wraps this round or whether he sits back. I think he might sit back because the werewolf. Hmm. So you can cage it up pretty well if he needs to. Just got enough players to move. Yeah. Oh, pal. already going to have a lot of room. Oh, 
Yeah. Oh, oh my god, these armor rolls, man. Oh, he's going to put a foul in here. Let's go. Ooh. He's going to leave this ball horribly exposed. So, yeah, he's got to run that mm. bodyguard back and boot him in the head. Come on. Okay, oh, yep. that's good. Yeah, that's yeah. good. That's good. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> and double yeah, P. Oh, oh, right in the right in the nuts, and oh that's out. Oh my god! And it doesn't get sent off as well. He, he stepped on him in the dick, Demi. There was no. Yeah, I saw, that. I saw he that. He was gone. <laughs> His Frankenstein dick. Yeah. His bolts and nuts gone. <laughs> yeah. Huge foul. Oh. I can I can feel Jim going <laughs> <laughs> wavering. Fucking love fouls. I love fouling in this game. It's I mean, it's so hit good. and miss. That was it a pretty is, great foul. That was a pretty a great, great foul. foul. Yeah, on a it's golem It's satisfying as well. when it works. Yeah. It's so satisfying. I guess because he... Because um, he removed one of the wraiths, it stopped Jimmy doing the setup that he normally does, which like prevents the golem getting too deed. Because like, he normally does yeah. it in a way, like, he normally sets up in a way where like they're all protecting each other, so you can't really 2D anyone without being yeah. left place and stuff. But because he's missing a wraith, that got his golem KO'd as well. Oh yeah. my fucking god, I thought I was blitzing with a fucking ghoul, and I just said I'd accidentally blitzed with a wolf. I did face. wonder, I was like, that's a uh, <laughs> fucking amazing that's... play. Frenzy trap yourself. Top form. Top form, Jiminy. Oh. Uh, uh... Is it a oh well? my god! Didn't, didn't self removal though. He, he, I'd say he kept himself safe, but Hunter's more than willing to foul the shit out of that. Oh god! Oh god! What a disaster! I, that's insane. Like I just literally thought I'll blitz with a girl, and then everything will be all right, and then just yeah. accidental, accidental wolf blitz. I've played yeah. shit this Super League. I've got no regrets about not making the playoffs. I just played shit. You did all right last uh, last drive, I think. It was—I mean—you had a hard time. The dice were not not friendly to you the first couple turns, but <laughs> yeah, just having to get the ball sacked was fucking shit. <laughs> the ball sack, losing a, a wraith turn two. Yeah, yeah, that just meant that I had to get the ball sacked. I don't know why else I could have done yep. it except just like so enjoy yeah, your I ball mean... sack. <laughs> yep. And tackle yep. hit as well. I didn't, always didn't blitz and wasn't screwed. Oh, oh fucking it's fine. Oh, it's just no, drive lost. Fine. Game may be lost. Yeah. Fuck me. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> you might be a salvage to draw here. No, it's over, Jim. Just quit. <laughs> Give up sometimes. He's in a rough spot, yeah. That's he literally it. exactly the same as the game against Andy where I didn't stand firm and it led to my wolf getting removed. This time I didn't blitz with a fucking ghoul and it got my ghoul removed. Just fucking awful. Awful fucking shit. Yeah. That's not good, is it? If you uh, ever want any coaching, Jimmy, I, I'll I'll do your mates right. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jim. <laughs> no worries, man. I got you. I got you, Jim. It what? <laughs> <laughs> what? So every turn, you should think to yourself. Am I a moron? <laughs> oh, oh my god. Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh. Zombie stays up, too. Yeah. Disappointing. Has he left this? He's... Not really. Yes, it looks alright. Looks alright. He's got some penetration. Hey. Oh, and he's putting in the foul. Oh, he doesn't get it. What a Dyson. What a Dyson. Unbelievable. Oh, disappointing pal. And the arm break. Just as fun, though. Oh, he's, he's looking at balls. He's just looking here. at it. Yeah, I mean, One, it's. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It could be on. It is on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, although the Wraith, you can't really get the Wraith in, so it looks like it'll be a 1D. Yeah. 
it's just like how do you you know you, you don't really have any recovery afterwards. And it's double GFI. It's double GFI no recovery, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This could just be reroll burn. Nope. Doesn't get him. I don't think he needed to get him to be honest. Uh just a double GFI into nothing. Yeah. He's got so, no one with hands, has he? <laughs> now yeah, the guy with hands is based on a bodyguard as well. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he could, what, 1D with the the Wraith to make it a 3 plus dodge out with the other wolf. It's not good, though. Uh... Oh, yeah, yeah, 1D. Yeah, I guess. I mean, it's a 2 plus. And then he's got a three plus out. Three plus. Yeah. And then depending on where this ball goes, I don't know. It's hard to say. I don't think I don't think he's doing much either way. If he goes to the ball sack. Yeah, I mean you could Unless three plus, two plus, two plus to get the wraith on the ball. And then it's a two plus black into a two plus black, right? What three yeah. But then if he fails it he just collapses and it's it's a tough one. Yeah. It's not easy. It's not easy. And that's the thing, if Chunter scores and these two KOs don't come back, then it's suddenly like game on, like it's uh Yeah, oh yep, doesn't even go for it. I don't think I don't think so. Like it was there but I don't I like you say there's no real recovery. If you had someone that could like pick it up afterwards, I think maybe like a ghoul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I get to stun, that's you know. Pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Problem is he's just gonna come through the middle here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The one or there. Nope. Nice one D Jim. Where did you get it? Chain. Uh <clears throat> uh Yeah, he can just chain something out need, here. Doesn't even need to really chain, he can just two dice the wolf. No, I just mean to get the ball through the middle. Oh, to get the ball through the middle? Yeah, he, he wants to get the ball through the middle. Like, in, into range for next turn. Like I, I feel like he should be going for the winner. I don't know, it depends what he's... Well, I mean, I think he could. He just... block, let's block. Yeah. Yeah, so two dice there. In two dice the... Oh, the follow... That's weird. Yep. Oh, is he just gonna blitz the wolf and then come down the side? Yeah, maybe. This is cool. Mhm. Mm and then you just ignore the wraith. Yeah. Is yeah. wrestle gonna be OP? It's not. Oh. Saved him getting knocked over, but that's about it. The iffy thing with this though is he's gonna get surfed because he has to leave him on the edge there. Yep. <laughs> But not not much you can do about that. I mean, it, it, it is a red dice without more dodges, right? So the uh, the guard. And what? Yeah. Uh... Yep. Hit him. And probably. Probably follow there. All right, just to keep the uh, get the other wolf tagged. Oh, what? Follow this one. Yeah. 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 And then two D the roof. Uh, I don't know that you do. Uh, why not? If you don't get him down. He gets in a better spot, I guess. Oh, well. Just punch him, mate. Punch him. Bang, bang, yeah. bang. We've gone full Eliod here. Full bang. Just, full bang mode. You always yeah, I guess you can. And then if you don't knock him down and he dodges backwards, you just don't hit him a second time. Because then you do free him. Then you really do just get your, your ball sacked. Doesn't, oh, doesn't hit it. I didn't think he would. The only issue with this is that. Oh, I guess the wolf is a frenzy trap anyway. Yep. So he can free a wolf here, but it doesn't 
help too much. Uh, Chunter getting all of those KOs back hurt quite a bit. Yeah, and if these two KOs stay out, then it's like it's really game on. Yeah. I mean, there's some pretty huge KO rolls. Especially the Blodge Ghoul. Well, and the Golem, to be fair, they're both pretty huge. They're both huge. Maybe a hit here. That's still two into one, though, isn't it? It's the guard day. Yeah. I always wonder if you just hit with the Wraith. Then move the one wolf to sub to assist and then just Or you just blitz with blitz. the block wolf, yeah. Yep. Oh, oh, he's going for it. That's a... Uh... This is what I love about knobs. <laughs> so what do you wanna yeah. do? You take yeah. the push, I won't stand firm, you have one D, or you take the wrestle and you're on the floor. And I can move yeah. next time, yeah. So it's into oh. one. However, the, red, which the reds were good to him last time. Yeah, double powers on it. Double powers on the reds. This is one. This is one D though, right? If he goes to the right. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. If he goes to the right, it's one D. He should definitely not stand firm though, yeah. Oh, I thought that was a skull. Oh my god. And a removal. And a KO. What a Dyson. Comedy Mega. But I mean, what do you do? It's still not it's still not a whole lot here. Oh well, no, I mean it's just it's another bit of variance for the early score, right? Because if that yeah. if Jim now gets the two players back and that bodyguard doesn't come back, like there's a Oh. If he gets a removal here, he can even take the ball. He does. Oh my he god. He does get the removal. Alright. We we do have a game. And now the score is even scarier because it's like oh, you might be able to just dodge out the wraith. Yeah, now it's real scary. Oof. Now you've got some problems. That last removal was brutal. It was. The first removal was just kind of nice. The second removal was... Yeah, let him get through and actually... Devastating. Into immediate double skulls. Into it... loner double skulls. Oh my god. No, that wasn't even loner. Uh, oh, and the glorious! <laughs> oh my god. Never oh, in doubt. Holy shit. Never in holy doubt. Holy shit. <laughs> Comedy mega. Comedy oh mega. Oh my oh, god. What a walk in the park. I told you all. Nobs. What a game. <laughs> What a game! <laughs> wow. Yeah, GG Junior. That was that wow. was really scary. Yeah, so I got really lucky at certain points. Didn't oh, I? it was. <sighs> it was a game. It was a fun game. It was a way more fun game to watch than the previous one. Yes. Yeah. 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 It was fun. Even me watching it, I could think, "Whoa, whoa, this is a fun one to watch." <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it wasn't quads, was it? It was. A, it was the ogre that dub skulled, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So it was. It was just because it showed the bonehead roll, which is. Actually, the loner role. It's weird. Right. So it was the like. Nice wasn't weird about it. It was more like a 1 in 72 than 1 in 12, 9, 6, but uh, still very, very lucky to get that. <laughs> yeah, yeah well, both halves are interesting. First half, like the, that fucking. The Wraith removal just meant I, my, my offense was in tatters, wasn't it? The fucking Ogre. The Ogre was like so good. The Strength 5 guard was just so hard to deal with. And then, yeah, the surfs, chains into surfs, yeah, yeah. I was watching all of those, yeah. Chunter, and I was thinking, oh, there's so many chains in the surfs here. But, uh, no, you did well to avoid that, and then, yeah, eventually had to pull yeah. back. And then, um, yeah, it was really scary, though, really. Re it could have been 2-0 on another day, couldn't it? It could have been 2-0 to Chunts on another day. But um, I think even the second half was interesting. There was yeah. a lot of... There was times where we're like, well, Chunter's lost this. Oh, nope, Jimmy, Jimmy's lost this. Oh, nope, Chunter's lost this again. Like, oh, my God. Uh... It was so swingy. It was, you know, 
anybody's game for a long time there. Yeah, the instant flesh removal was horrible. The being down the raid, so I had to expose him. He got instantly removed. I was like, oh my god. But then the uh, the wolf removal into the, the miss splits. <laughs> oh god, yeah, the miss splits. Fuck me, man. Yeah, if you're thinking, Chunter, why I'm the biggest idiot in the world, um, it's because I thought I just like I literally thought I was going to blitz with my ghoul, and I thought I'd clicked on the ghoul, and then I'd, all of a sudden I found I've blitzed with my wolf, and like. Absolutely fucked, and then that exposed my ghoul, which then got removed. Double whammy, just the same as the Devo match, but you know, yeah, it's bad play, isn't it? No excuses. It was just, it was just awful, awful play. Uh, but it was punished to the absolute maximum degree both times. <laughs> Funnily yeah. enough, but still, um, I mean that's good. It's good for you, Jim, like to get punished maximum. Like it's, it's not, it's not, Jim. It's it not. just enforces like it like reinforces the the mistake right it's but i still made the, i mistake. still made the mistakes didn't i so it's not it's not really it's not really true but if you make a massive mistake and you get away with it then it's like yeah but i mean i'm still really making the mistakes i still it was both basically kind of misclicks right like i just like miss i miss like i mean it was essentially a misclick yeah i blitz with a wolf instead of a girl and i chose a not stand firm instead of a stand firm so maybe i should try and just take a little bit longer to not misclick but, um, yeah. There you go. Maybe that's yeah, the lesson well, to learn. You did well in that first half. You really did build around that ball. Yeah. Yeah. Like it was, it was rough. <laughs> it was rough for Jim. Yeah, it was. It was so bad. It was so bad that I just had to let myself get like get ball sacked <laughs> against Chunter of all yeah. people. So like it was like, oh god, <laughs> yeah. this is awful. Like you know, if if it was against Art, maybe he'd not bother. But like, yeah, it's versus Chunter. He's definitely just going to two D sack yeah. me. Um, yeah, leaving a ball sack open against Chunter is like leaving a surf on against Devo. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, except without really there being a downside to sacking the ball. So yeah, it was pretty yeah. bad. <laughs> yeah. um, but yeah, there's nothing I could really do. I thought after losing that wraith, like the 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 ogre was just undealable with. Basically, it was because I just didn't have enough guard. Did I only had three guard versus six? So it was, it was brutal. When he removed that fleshy, I thought for sure, like, well, it's a draw at best for Jim. Yes, yeah, that was right. That was pretty backbreaking. But then, oh man, the the the. I quite like my player, the double GFI, uh, you know, flesh golem to uh, to help yeah. out, and then um, yeah, obviously very lucky to get the exceedingly lucky to get the removal. The double KOs, yeah. yeah. Jim. Well, yeah, the, the first awesome. the first one didn't really matter. The second one was huge because it just let me let me get there without dodging, didn't it? So, Dude, Jim died. Yeah. Save two, three plus dodges getting the removal, and obviously his recovery yeah. was was massively hampered by it as well. So yeah, they were they were huge. Yeah. That was a huge one. The first one wasn't wasn't big. It was second one massive. Um, the the first one would have been massive as the game went, but it wasn't for that turn. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So that concludes uh, the the regular season of the Super League. So. You can see that Andy Davo, five wins out of five, only one touchdown conceded, max points, and uh, Seabros pit me by one point. Um, very, very sad. Even if I'd got the draw against Andy, um, Seabros would have beat me on head to head because he beat me, and you know, so I, I did lose to first and second, so I can't really complain. Um, but yeah. you know, is what it is. First time I've missed out on the playoffs. I did. Um, very sad. Yeah. And then Hiru Sol Chunter becomes the first person to ever go zero zero five in Super League, which every season I've said there's no shame in it, right? Because it's just like it's it's pretty easy for someone to go zero zero five in this. There's, it's an end of an era. Um, it, I, this actually is the end wow. of an era. Yeah, I've gotten the final four times in a row. Uh, this time didn't even make the playoffs. And uh, yeah, so that's, there's, there's never going to be any shame in like you know finishing badly because there's just everyone in the league is really good, aren't they? So it's uh, it's completely normal. And then Group B, we've got Diamed also with Necromantic, um, and he went four one zero six one six one. So both both top both groups topped by Necromantic, both conceding one touchdown. Uh, Monitor in second place because he got the head to head versus Core K Fogged, however you want to say it, um, in second nine five five. Very like so, runaway winner in this group, and everybody else very close two one two, and you know one one three bottom there. Olivier Dulac, the number one ranked NAF player in the world, because this is how uh, this is how good this is. So there you go. No um, big Kev in the playoffs is sad. It is, man. yeah. But he brought it on himself. He used Imperial he ability. I mean, come he on. He did. Yeah, he brought knobs. <laughs> yeah. I mean. <laughs> 
Yeah, totally. That would have been exciting, right? K Fog with knobs, I still put as not. I don't put him to lose, right? No, yeah, exactly. Yeah, and if he hadn't misclicked, maybe he wouldn't have. Yeah, you know, but he he, yeah. he made some he made some horror misclicks and and stuff. Uh, so yeah, but K Fog did it with knobs, and uh, yeah, it's not bad. So we've got we've got Diamed versus Seabros and Andy Davo versus Monitor. So both semi-finals are Elves versus Necromantic. And uh, very exciting. So there you go. Um, that is that is the Super League regular season. Only three games left. And uh, yeah, funnily enough, actually, I did finish second, didn't I? I? I finished second in my group. So no, I didn't finish third. Oh my god, I was the first one out of the playoffs. So Necro were two of the top five. Well, they were the best two teams were Necro. And even though I didn't make the playoffs, I was still the fifth best team. So yeah, very very strong showing by Necro but not quite as strong as the Orcs the previous season where <laughs> three of the four playoff teams were Orcs. <laughs> uh, they are definitely seen the best two teams in the Euro Bowl format. And um, thank you very much, Moridam and Dimi, for uh, nicely, nicely talking in that while I was trying to concentrate. Yeah, Cheers, no problem. Guys. Yeah, well played, Jim. Thanks. Yeah. And, uh, and of course, thanks to Chunter as well. It was, it was you know, some brutal things for him there. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.